bring him up to bark at you. Yep. Best to take a picture from a side angle. Yep. All right, ready? Come here. Good boy. Good boy, Gunner. He's going to guard you now. Now, John, when you go to move, you'll just make sure that you don't lift your arm high or he'll come in and grab your chest. Yep. All right? So the dog tends to take the closest limb. For example, John, if you were to go over that fence and your leg was the closest limb to the dog's mouth, the dog would take the leg. Gunner does leg bites, arm bites. So basically, if you just stay like that and do a quick walk toward JD real fast, all of a sudden start moving, see if you can move real quick. Go ahead. Ah, he's got you, John. Can you feel the pressure? Yep. Let's get a few words from John Robbins. All right, John, how are you making out? This is a big dog. <laughs> Try not to kiss the microphone. This is a big dog. Big dog. You sound funny when you breathe like that. Uh, keep moving around, John. Yeah, that's it. What else do you want to say to everybody, John? Should everybody try this at least once? Should this be something on the bucket list? Yes, yeah, JD made it look easy. <laughs> okay, now, here we go, John. I'm going to give you a little task, okay? Yep. You see over there where they have all the decorations? Watch that little dog, though. Yep. Okay, see right there? That's yep. that little tent there. Run there, John, with a dog on your arm. Mm. Run as fast as you can, John Robin. Let's see what you're made of. <laughs> Come on, John. Unleash the testosterone. <laughs> you can do it, John. You're doing a great job. As the audience now erupts into a fit of spontaneous applause for John Robbins! Yay! Good boy, Gunner. Keep moving, John, because I'm going to keep him on you for an hour. <laughs> Dave, is this uh, the way that you're going to desensitize John to figure yes. out what kind of breed of dog he wants? Uh, yeah. Hey, when I studied animal behavior at the University of Guelph, this is referred to as flooding. You do not desensitize this way. This is a bit much, actually. You gradually desensitize people. You don't just say, hey, wear a bite suit and attack a dog, <laughs> send a dog on the poor man. So I think we skipped a few steps, right, Deb? Is that what you're implying? Maybe we should have just had John walk past the dog first. <laughs> Good point, Deb. All right, John, don't you move a muscle now. Yep. Out! Good boy. You stay still. Don't you move a hair on that head of yours, John. I'm warning you. Because if you try and move sometime in the next five seconds, that's your hint to actually do that, then <laughs> the dog will nail you like you deserve to be nailed. Now stay still, John. Out! Good boy. You see what I mean? You don't screw with the dog showing you his pearly whites. All right, you could try moving in another five seconds. I think Gunner can count. Give it a shot. Try and make a fast break, John. Ah, the boy, John. Now run toward me, John. Run. Great, John. Now, can you run over there to the Johnny on the spot? Okay, keep running, John. Run, you're doing a great job. John, I'm just going to go get coffees. I'll be back in a while. <laughs> doing a great job, John. Keep running around with the dog on your arm. It's good for your back. Oh, i got to sit down. All this talking is wearing me out. My God. Oh, man, tired. he's pumping. It's great. Hey, John, you got to come back on the radio show one day when you're not so busy with the dog on your arm. John, why don't you run this way? John, why don't you run this way? Hello, John. Let me know when you've had enough, John, for real. If you feel you're going to puke, I'll take the dog off you. Yeah, I'm good now, I think. Are you good now? Is that my cue to get off my tush? All right. So I'm going to let make the dog let go. Yeah. Oh, good boy, Gunner. Gunner, poos! Yeah, Gunner's having trouble barking up. we got to give him a break. Oh,